surprisingly clear, isn't it? Yeah. Record how many sides it can play. Yeah. I think it's just the one. Yes. The but that's one. enough, isn't it, for yeah. a machine of well, that size? I think if I had a new spring, it'll probably run a 12 inch. Right. It's just about as a 12. I did mm. try it, but it's just borderline. Yeah, mm. the, the, the 12 is just a bit borderline. Yeah. Some it will, some it won't. Yeah. But it's you basically what it is it's the case is built around a full size gramophone motor. Yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. not as if it's a toy. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you've got a full about three quarter inch spring in that. Yeah, yeah. The only problem is the on that one the barrel is so soft. Yeah. Take the lid off, it starts to distort. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. oh it dear, one of those, yes. Get the barrel back on again. Oh, I just yeah, about yeah, matched it. Yeah. You end up with it, the t lid looking plannish. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, <that's laughs> right. yeah. it is a bit bent which somebody's tried to, mm. but because um, there was no grease in that one at all, it just dried out and it Good was just really so had to get some grease yeah, into it. I don't know which is worse, no grease or, 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 or a dried up black mm. grease. That, mm. that, yeah. I mean, I, I took spring, springs out, mm. took the cover off the spring, mm. the spring inside is fully wound. Yes, yes, yes. And, and, yeah. and, and, and ready to go. And, and you think, God, what now? What do I do? <laughs> yeah. I mean, you, you take the cover off, I said, God, the spring is fully wound. Well, I that happen. Uh, and I thought, well, any minute there is, it's going to unwind. So well, I had that happen. Yeah, I, I, put it in a, I, I put it in a bag and uh, put it in a little yes. uh, yeah. canvas bag and dumped it in a can of petrol. Yeah. Oh, right, yes, And then yes. It, it opened itself out in the little bag. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I remember <coughs> there used to be a dealer in Burford. I can't remember who he was. He had quite a big antique shop. And he had a big floor standing one that wouldn't play. And so he asked me, can I go and have a look at it? And it, it felt as if it was fully wound, but it wouldn't run. So anyway, I brought it home. I made sure, as far as I could, <laughs> that it was it was unwound. <laughs> then I took the barrel out. <laughs> and the first lid I took off, it was like that in the middle. Yeah. It went. Oh dear! And there was a metal sleeve in the middle of yeah. the spring, and it ricocheted around that garret <laughs> like, a, like it went like a bull. I'll tell you. Yeah. Hear it going from wall to wall. Yeah. And then 